NASA expected to release first light images of its new James Webb Space Telescope, and it's pretty awesome. Yeah, so this was the first one that was released yesterday at a press conference. They're going to release some more later on today. This it proves we're not alone. <laughs> CBS Four's <laughs> Daniel Backus has more of the big reveal. Today is a historic day. This photo shows an area of outer space humans have never seen before. President Biden released the image taken by the new James Webb Space Telescope Monday evening. A historic moment for science and technology, for astronomy and space exploration, for America and all of humanity. This image shows the galaxy cluster known as SMACS 0723 as it appeared 4.6 billion years ago. It's a composite made from images of different wavelengths over 12 and a half hours. And it's just one photo capturing the deepest part of space. NASA's unveiling more images Tuesday. Light where stars were born and from where they die. Light from the oldest galaxies, the oldest documented light in the history of the universe. Decollage liftoff from a tropical rainforest to the edge of time itself. James Webb begins a voyage back to the birth of the universe. NASA, partnering with the European and Canadian Space Agency, sent the $9 billion Webb Observatory into space last Christmas. Its mission is to look back about 13.7 billion years shortly after the Big Bang. The Webb's images will help scientists understand understand how stars, star clusters, planets, galaxies, and black holes are formed while unraveling some of the universe's biggest mysteries. Donya Backus, CBS News. Said so the Webb Telescope is the world's biggest and most powerful space telescope and successor to the aging Hubble Telescope, which has stared back as far as 13 point four billion years into the universe. Webb will go even deeper, capturing the faintest light in the universe dating back at least 13.7 billion years. It is fascinating. They're going to reveal four more photos later on.